it's five o'clock we've had a cup of tea we're all back wrapped up and we're heading back out for tea time leanne's just said that she's she's gonna get on a uh, prague lager tonight so yeah. might be carrying her home I ain't no other love. <laughs> yeah, no, she ain't. <laughs> Come out for the evening. We've just had a break in the hotel and it's turned dusky dark now, hasn't it? Yeah, it is. It's, although it's cold, I'm quite fine so I'm completely wrapped up. And Oliver's just been saying how Prague has got such a cool vibe to it. Yeah, I mean, it's freezing, but everyone's starting about and hustling and bustling and it doesn't seem to... There's just something to do everywhere you look. So everyone seems to be like just right in, it's just the right cool place basically. So we've been walking about and we've found the Jean, Jean, have I got that accent, Jean Palak Memorial. It's Charles's Bridge in it. Yeah. By night. Going on a lovely little stroll at the side of the river. It's gorgeous here. We've just been looking over at Castle. Just turn it right quick. It's all Castle over here, look. It's just wicked. It's right nice. Um, it's like those little restaurants and like, they look like boats, but I think they're like purpose-built buildings, but it's just gorgeous. It's almost romantic if I were here with somebody else. Oh. <laughs> We've just found, we've come around this corner and we've just found Charles's Bridge and this is like the, the walkway through. We've just come around this corner, we've got Charles's Bridge and then whatever that is behind us. And this to the side. You just can't get bored in Prague, there's no nah, way. Nah. Every corner you turn there's something different. This is it. We are going to step our feet on Charles's <laughs> Bridge and it feels like it's the most iconic bridge in Prague. The most iconic bridge in the world that's to be fair. <laughs> um, the statue is all, all lying in the bridge so we're going to go and have a look and uh, see what it's all about. Even though it's dark, I'm sure it'll still be good. So here we are at the robotic bar. Yeah, and Leanne's found a bar for us to go in. And we're going in. Off we go, <laughs> Oliver. Show me the way. Taste the experience of the future and enjoy a tasty drink from our robotic bar. <laughs> Welcome to the first robotic bar in the Czech Republic. Taste the experience of the future and enjoy a tasty drink from our robotic bartenders. Is it weird that I'm a bit nervous? So I think it's cocktails, because if you look up here, dry cool. Shall we just, well, just start a one. What do you want? There's a skinny bitch, do you think it'll make me skinny? <laughs> oh, where? Funny redder. What are you having? I'm gonna have a. Uh, don't know. Yeah, that's a bit rude. It's asking how old you are. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah, that is so cool. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ako. <laughs> I wonder what you're waiting for. So, I've just got a drink now, I've not tasted it yet, but I'll be honest with you, I'm not bothered what it tastes like. That was the most fascinating drink I've ever had in my life. It's just wicked watching it work. How absolutely epic! <laughs> Cheers! Oh, really nice! It's so cool! It's brilliant! Like, I know normally when you go to the pub, like back in England, and only entertaining things, steep sat in corner, you know, slouching or whatever. This is brilliant. Absolutely, you could sit watching this. It's oh. wicked just to watch, it's brilliant. There's six guys come in just after us, so we're sat here now, just a mesmerised bit machine going to it, doesn't it? It's very cool. Now 10 o'clock and we nipped home for Oliver to have a wee. Our restaurant that we wanted to go right, to <laughs> were closed. He bloody were. <laughs> um, and, well, we've just had a sandwich, really, because we're that tired, you can tell. Look, all my mascara is now underneath my eyes and look, Oliver's all swollen and marder. <laughs> um, so Oliver's had a glass of wine and it's day two now <clears throat> in Prague and I've still not had a chimney cake. So our excitement for the night, because we're so rock and roll, to go out and have a chimney cake. But we're gonna go out and have a chimney cake. And then we might even have a cheap beer. I might come up and go in the shower and no, get in bed. No, Oliver might have a cheap beer. We might have a cheap beer. Chimney cake shut. <laughs> chimney cake place open. <laughs> I don't know what we're having. I don't know. What do you fancy? <coughs> so I've gone for a number 14. Oliver has gone for a number four. Thank you. So this, guys, is an apple strudel chimney cake. It's nice and warm. Um, I don't know what's going off on the base there, but we're going to go for it. I've got chocolate and whipped cream. I mean, that's chocolate and whipped cream. Actually, it's nice, though. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Mmm, why that one is. Very nice. Yeah, that whipped cream's lovely. The whipped cream's right nice. I like that it's warm. It doesn't just taste like, it tastes like thicker than our whipped cream. Our Mine's whip like chocolatey. Our whipped cream feels right airy. This one, it feels quite creamy. Um, it's really sweet, the apple bit. Um, it's nice and warm, so we're going to dip in. So, look at this. How cool is this? So it's filled with dipped cream, uh, whipped cream, and then it's got apple all the way in it, which is, ooh, really nice. Is it warm? Mmm. Can you try a little bit? No, oh, thank you. don't like apple. He's <laughs> tried a bit. I've made him. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I, don't like, I don't like it. Uh, I quite like the chimney cake concept. It's cool. Do you like it? Yeah, I've waited a long time for this. And it feels <laughs> like I just had to do it in Prague. So, yeah, I'd, I'd recommend you've got to try one of these, haven't you? Yeah. I'm going to try fried cheese next and some beer. Coming back to the hotel to eat this because there is no sure way <laughs> <laughs> to eat this in a dignified manner on a street. I'm, I'm just getting covered. Actually, I weren't looking for. Well, I'm not looking for. I weren't not looking forward to it, but I was a bit apprehensive. But the gorgeous, right nice. Cheers! Another like traditional. I'm saying it's traditional, I don't think it is, but another thing ticked off in Prague. We are going to, well, Oliver will probably drink wine. Um, I'm going in the shower because I am mucky and my hair's greasy. And that is the end of our day two in Prague. Yeah, so we'll see you on the next one. Hope you enjoyed it and um, catch you soon. Bye. Oh, look at all of them. <laughs> Trump. <laughs>